Twitch work with me. Oh no, what's happened here? <laughs> the game can't be broadcasted. Right, give me a second. Let me check Twitch. Oh, this happened when I was on stream with Days for Eek. Oh, I don't know what's going on. I don't know what's happening. I need to message Cornish. It's live on Twitch. What, can you like see my uh, F1 screen? Uh, I've got an ad, I'll tell you in a sec. Yeah, I see it. Oh, there is. Never mind. Okay. <laughs> uh, hello, everyone. Welcome to Division 2 of Season 6. We're at Spain today. Sorry for that weird intro. I do not know what happened there. But, um, yeah. Uh, today, I'm your streamer, Unity Hush. My first time back on the comms box. I'm replacing RSF1 Hunt, who unfortunately is taking a break from comms because he, he just wants a break, which I understand. We all go through one of them phases at some point, so... Hopefully he has a nice break, but today, for the second night in a row, I'm joined by Mr. RSF1 in Bayd. How are you? I'm very glad to see what the second best division should do, seeing, seeing I commentated over the first yesterday. Yep, yeah, and we've already got a spinner off CW. <laughs> oh no. Come on, Red Bull, you got this. <laughs> um, yeah, so um, I think you're regular, regular. Um, CoCom of Division 2, am I correct? Uh, yeah, I was on CoCom's last week. Okay, um, it. do you know who the rough front runners are at the moment? Like, who is the one to, to set the pace? Or is it, uh, like, so close you can't tell? It's very close. You'll find yeah. that out in this. Yeah, I'm hoping, I'm hoping to see some um, close times. I want to see the top 10 separate by half a tenth. That's what I want to see. It's most likely going to happen. <laughs> um, the first person on a lap in Q1, I think. I haven't done this in a while, bear with me, guys. Crazy Fish. Yes, in the Alfa Romeo. Uh, I can remember racing with Crazy Fish last season. He actually picked up his first podium at Spain this time last season. So, yeah. He, he, he is a good driver. I've seen the Division 2 racers. He's been quite unlucky sometimes, but I'm hoping he can get some good luck on his side to uh, all my CW to get some more podiums. But let's see what Crazy Fish sets because CW do have, did have that spin. Crazy Fish. 16 7. Now, what did we. Oh, we had wet in F1, didn't we? Yeah. Yeah. So you won't know the pace comparison. Yeah, that is true. We won't know the pace compared to F1 Division. Um, while we're here in Vade, do you have the standings on you by any chance? Uh, yeah. I'll go through Constructors first. Yes. Starting in 10th, we, we have Alpine on 8 points. 9th, we have Haas on 14 points. 8th, we have Red Bull on 21 points. 7th, McLaren on 22 points. 6th, Ferrari on 23 points. 5th, Williams on 27 points, 4th, Alfa Romeo on 37 points, 3rd, Alfa Tari on 39 points, 2nd, Aston Martin on 53 points, and 1st place is Mercedes so far. So Mercedes are setting the pace. I've, I do know IGN Legends had picked up 2 podiums so far, so yeah. Um, Cornish just drivers. said the driver standings are incorrect, but if you just want to read mine anyway, so we can get a, like, a rough idea of like, where people are in the division, if you don't mind. Yeah, I'll go through what's been updated here. Uh, yeah. Evo, Cornet Start, IOR, Biscuit, and Matty, all on zero points. Forzen, uh, for Horizon, 40, Storage, both on two points. Eyes of the best on three points. The 
Uh, RSF1C Todd is on three, no, five points. Crazy Fish is on six points. Caesar Two Wizard is also on six points. Camo is on eight points. JJ Hudson's on twelve. BF on race is on nineteen. So to is Cornish on nineteen. Quirky Tales on twenty. CW's on twenty one. Roberts is on twenty six. Grunty's on twenty seven. I IGN Legends is on thirty five and the championship leader is Muddy Biscuit. Oh wait no. <laughs> Mr. He's in the Pigeon Munch. Munch. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Pigeon Munch is on 39 points just because Muddy Biscuit was in this division last season, I think. Yeah, he was. Oh. <laughs> it's okay. Uh, Roberts, only 10,000 away from Crazy Fish, who's currently top of the session. Then we have the two Aston Martins. Well, I hope stop stop scoring some big points because we need to catch them in the overall constructors. Uh, yeah, I don't hope that. Well, I think all other nine teams do, so it's nine against one here in Vegas, so I'm very sorry about that. Yeah. Cornish, I'm 20 points behind after three races. Sad times. Oh, hydrate, says Verstappen. Oh, I need to get some water. I'll do that in a minute. Uh, yep, Cornet Star is going to be next person set a lap. What's he going to do? 16 8 as well. Crazy Fish. He's setting the early pace. Storage. Now, this man we need to talk about. Storage. Early yeah. on in the week, I heard he was setting some blistering times that no one could match. So I'm expecting to see some quick times from Storage today. Even I haven't on him, seen the Williams team. any of his lap times so far. I think this is his first race back this season. Cause I remember the last season he said he was going to miss the first three races. So, nice to see you back, Sturridge. Yeah. Oh, Mr. BF on race star, this inner Spinella car himself. He's gone purple in sector one, but I believe that's personal best, not fastest. I mean, it could be because he was up there last week. Pretty sure uh, he had Portugal, yes it was, yes, Portugal. I know he was pole sitter in Imola. I'll, I think. I'll, just, I'll say he was on pole and he won last week's race in second. JJ Hudson was on pole at Portugal with Lives taking the win who Lives went up to Division 1. Mr. BF1 Racer, what are you going to do? Are you going to go faster than Crazy Fish or are you going to go in the 8s as well? Let's have a look. Wow, this is close already. My goodness. 20,000 separating the top three. Alright, where is he? Where's the man at the moment? Here he is. Mr. Sturridge. Let's see what he's going to set. Come around the final corner. What's he going to do? Ugh. I won't lie, I do expect this from storage. What? 16 fives? I know, I was expecting to be near the front after his times in the week, week practice. Oh, okay. But from last season, I do remember he didn't have the best of starts to the races, so hopefully he's been working on that. Is that a spin in sector 1 from one of Mercedes? I believe it is. Mm, I think it's Tornado. One board Mr. Pigeon Munch now, who is a contender after the first four races. He was um, a championship contender last season, uh, but then, you know, he got very unfortunate in many races, so. Oh, he's not on that, never mind. Okay. I'll talk about you later, Pigeon Munch. No. <laughs> uh, Legends, I think he had that spin, yeah, no EOS, he's not on all that. Uh, Gunty. Gunty goes quicker, or 16.8. Ben went quicker. Oh yeah, Ben did go quicker. He's on second fastest. Oh, Grunty pulled out. Here is the man of the moment, Mr. RSF on Cornish, which I've been told he's been getting quite a few penalties around this track and even may get disqualified. Sorry Cornish, but I had to say that. I mean, it's no surprise he gets a lot of pens. 
Yeah, it's a shame. He's got the pace, but the pen does boot. Oh, there, there he goes. Turn two. Yeah, it's a shame with corners. He's got the pace to be up there, but the pen's just dropping back in the final result. So yeah. I do think he can challenge for the championship. But this ain't me being mean coins, but if you work on your pen, you would defo definitely be up there. Yeah, one hundred percent. Alright, see the two wizard in the Alpha Romeo. Let's see what he's gonna set. Yellow flag. I cannot see the time. I think it's grunt going very slow. Oh, slivering me, the toy party. I'm sick of seeing that. I won't lie. <laughs> I hope Tolly don't score many points. I hope they both crash out. I wouldn't go that far. <laughs> <laughs> well, I just hope they well, don't win. That's all I'll say. Who is in the alpha? It's Pigeon and Matty. Matty. Come on, CW. CW, need a good time here. Seven fastest, that will do. Look how close it is. One, two, three, four, five. Five drives on an eight. I was told close. this division is one of the closest ones. If not the closest. Ooh. Quirky Turtle, oh, Quirky Turtle, there we go, does a 0.5, goes second quickest. Horizon Let's get back on board and Mr. Pasta, man, let's see what he can set. Oh, he just went past the red ball at the end of Sector 1, hopefully that'll hinder him. Now it's short shift to third, lovely stuff, get that extra rotation. This corner's a tricky one, you want to be careful of the curb, Ben Wittar's in the pits, I believe, yes he does. Yeah. Corner. Be careful, don't take the exit curb, it can spin you. Oh, he's kept it valid. I can't tell if Ben's going to be safe with that lap. Because how close 16 is. set, yeah. We're only going to be losing because 15 four, is on the That's only 6 cents gap. Yeah, and for we know, they, that could have been a mistake on their lap. So, yeah, you could be right here. Ben's playing it risky. Here comes Pasta Man. What's he gonna set? P5. Oh, I, sh I just realised I should probably get the tyres up. Sorry, guys. It's been a while. Pretty sure they're all on the old softs. Yeah, I just need to see the tyre life. He did that on two lap old softs. CW's gonna get on two lap old softs. I do not think the tyres will last that long. I have to too. I don't know if it's his personal best. Oh, CW! No! Oh, oh no! no. No, CW! Has he lost oh, it? Turn two. Ball. Yeah, he, he went too wide and picked up a bit of grass or gravel, which, which oh. went wild, then just went into the curb. Curb? Wall. Oh no, CW. We have a lap time for my 16 8, I think he was going to be safe as well. Oh no. Who did you say went purple eyes? Did you? Oh no no no! One shot no! No! Right. Both red Same balls. Same place. Both red balls. Oh. Red ball, what are you doing to me? Oh no! Your red balls aren't having it. Oh no! Right. Oh. Oh. Oh, I can't this believe died. this. Oh no! Oh no. Both I red balls, same, same place. Your great, oh, no. your great result from yesterday is cursed him. I didn't mean to, guys, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh. I better not get using a meme with you, I swear to god. <laughs> oh, eyes, oh, ho, ho. Eyes is pitting, three minutes left. Interesting. We'll have enough time. Will he have enough time? Will he though? I reckon so. That will, he will that will, that was on three lap old soft, so he will have to take another set, which is going to hinder him. Oh, there's gel flags everywhere. Yeah, I think it's all Mercedes spun sector one. I don't like seeing people spinning there now. Tornado, who has now got a full time Mercedes seat after Connor Todd dropped to reserve, I believe. So yeah, that's his first sure. full time. I'm pretty sure, yes. Let's 
see what Tornado does. He does a 6, 17, 1. Close to his teammate. Yeah, Legends down there. I wasn't the eldest person Legends to be up there. And he's out of fuel. Oh, Legends could be in trouble here. He's out of fuel. Oh, Legend could be in a bit of bother here. Is Ard the best coming out? Do we see any sign from the McCallum garage? Look at that yeah. Williams 1 2. Oh, well, Locker's probably got a smirk on his face. <laughs> oh, it's F1 with Staffan. Is that you, Ben? Or is that someone else on your account? Oh, no, that's with Staffan Spin. Never mind. I think it is, anyway. Uh, Ooh, wait, is that, is that on a different set of stops? I think so, you know. It's, he's only had one lap on them. Risky straight. Alright, people in danger. We have one shot who unfortunately crashed. We've got Evo, we've got Matty, we've got Eyes, the best. I'm pretty sure Who's Matty will go quick either. He's been in oh, he's invalidated. I think that's him done. I don't know how much time's left in the session. Oh no! Oh, a minute left. He's, no, he's, okay, he's got a minute. He, he's got time. He's got time. He has the fuel. I was about to say. I've had, just, and go. I've had just given him the commentator curse. Right, Evo Mr. Evo. Two temps that will go. That will match IG and Legends. That'll put Legends down. So Legends is not safe at the moment. If Evo, Matty, and I's all improve, Legends is out of Q1. And I think he's second in the honest, championship. I don't think Roberts is safe. Robert, no, actually, Robert. yeah, it is. Yeah, he, he, yeah he's, he's safe because of uh, the. Cornet Star. Evo is going to cross the line. V8. Alright, Eyes and Matty, there's their only chance. One lap each. I just oh I just no oh I just spawned oh, out eyes. oh so unfortunate it's all down to Matty oh, now careful, careful. Okay. yeah so wait no legends ain't safe Matty improves legends is out he has to game all Matty needs to do though. yeah all Matty needs to do is to beat legends time and legends is out with Q1 Right on board with Matty for the final sector. Let's see how he takes it. What's this sector two looking like? One He's only a temp for. He needs to find four more temps. Left on this curve, lovely. Down to second. Oh, okay. Up to third. This this last few corners are tricky. You want to take it in third. Up to four. Down to second. Then up to back. Up to third. Yeah. Oh, that's going to cost him time. I don't think that's going to be enough. Yeah, he knows it. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, Matty's out. Legends gets through by the skin of his teeth. And the most annoying thing is, CW would have been through and he crashed. I am so gutted right now. So, eliminated from Q1, we have CW in the Red Bull who crashed at turn 2. We have Tornado in the Mercedes. We have Ripped in one shot who also crashed at turn 2. Matty in the Alpha Tori in 18th and I the best who unfortunately spawned on this final lap in 19th place and is starting last unless Biscuit decides to join the session. Which hopefully he does. I think he might not join because he's got a quality ban but I do think he might join for the race. Whether you're allowed to do that, who knows. Look how close it is. On P2 of storage, all the way down to Legends in P14, it's four temps. And then we have Quick Turtle topping the session with a 16 3. Storage making a Williams 1 2 with a 16 5. And then Mr. Pigeon Championship Leader in third with a 16 5 as well. Some great lap times. Yeah. Now, the question is. In Q2, will anyone start on the soft tyres? We don't know if it's a wet race or if it's a dry race. Don't tell us, please. Yeah, I was let, about let to say, keep guessing. I said 
I don't know, someone's gonna type in chat to the dry base. Oh, that'll be so annoying. Um. Oh yeah. Oh jeez. Everyone is selecting like the mediums. Well. Wow. Yeah. Legends coming out. He's gonna do a, a bank on the sauce. He ain't gonna do a push lap. I do expect everyone to do a, a bank on the sauce. It's too early to do your medium lap because you start. Yeah, the I think sauce. it might be a dry race. People going on mediums. Don't say this. <laughs> oh, Legends getting held by Pigeon Munch. I think that was. Yep. Everyone coming out on the softs. Ne never mind, Crazy Fish has come out on the mediums. So he will be the first person to set up F centers that time. Zar Brad W. <laughs> Let me just put my phone on charge. Yeah, I've got mine on charge. Don't want it to die. There we go. Both don't start a lap. Followed by Pigeon and Legend on softs. Now, Invade, I need to ask you this. Yeah? Spain, do you go out straight away on your mediums to get a lap in early, or do you go out later on when the tracks are in on your medium tyres? Honestly, go out early because you're going to risk it uh, if you go out late. It doesn't matter who you are, you have to go out early on them, set one lap, make sure they've got a tie lap or a second lap at the end. Well, I will attempt an onboard, guys, but I do not know the corner names, so, or the corners, so please, don't bully me in the comments. <laughs> Alright, Crazy Fist gets a nice exit out of the final corner, now on to the back straight, open that DRF. I'm going to do a Ben. Frontline speed! Oh, he's just going to give me a full out of 10 for that. Alright, down to turn one, let's see how he takes this on board. Take the inside curve, nicely done. Try, ride the inside of turn two, and then go wide as possible to take it full throttle. Is it? F yes, it is full throttle. Down to turn three, I believe. You want to go down to third, up to fourth. How does he do it? Yep. Hold the inside so you get the best run possible. You take the wider line. You want to take a wider line to this corner to get on the curve where the green stuff is. I don't know what it's called. Now down to the tricky corner, 7 I think it is, by right the inside curve, gets a bit wobbly out of the corner. Now down to 5th, no takes in, oh, oh, crazy fish. Gets a bit wobble but keeps it secure, does a 50.9 in the second sector, goes a bit wide for the apex. Now he needs to ride this curve on the inside which he doesn't need boys. Down to 2nd, up to 4th, ride the curve on the outside, gonna go down to 3rd. Up to fourth, so you're gonna go down to second. You need a good run out the final two corners. That this can break your lap or make it. Rides the outside curve now out the final corner. He's gonna come down the back straight. What's he gonna set? 17-4. And we saw 16-5 in Q1. So I didn't I actually think the medium does second slower. Pigeon one track to invalidated. Don't know where though. Um yeah, I think if you just go do a bank on your soft, you just invalidate. I think it's, it's oh, intentional, damn. really. You must have made a massive What's happened mistake. to BF1? He's made the massive oh, we'll mistake. Board, go on, we'll ride on board with Ben. Let's, let's see how he takes it for that. If he or that, I couldn't do that in fifth. Oh, lift off, lift off a bit. Bit of tank slap it off. Let's see what his first sector is. 1.2 seconds up. Yeah, he must have made a mistake in the first sector on the second. Cornish, oh yeah, I need a frontline speed redeem message. Yes, you do, Cornish. <laughs> I don't care if I get knocked out of Q2. I want to start the race on mediums. Oh, no one wants to start on the hards. That's it. Oh, Ben. Oh, Ben. <laughs> you almost lost it. Yeah, up the, going up that hill on the inside curb. If you know what I'm talking about. Before oh, I get yeah. Soon. Yeah. Both times I've bought, rided on board with Crazy and Ben, they've both done the exact same thing. So I think I should stop riding on board and go to broadcast. Ben's flashing with fuel. Is he pitting or is he setting the lap? He's going to set the lap. Right, let's see. 
Crazy Fish versus Ben, what the time's it gonna be? 17-6, Crazy Fish is looking quick tonight. I won't lie. Very quick. Oh, corner star. T. Is the hat on a lap? No, it's I think Gunty is the next one on the mediums. 22-2. Compared to Crazy Fish's 22-1, I believe. Oh, storage is invalidated. Ooh, is he on the softs? Mediums. Okay. Yeah, you you can do more pull-ups on your mediums, because the hards can go a long way into the race, so it's not the end of the world if you do like five laps on your mediums, but ideally you don't want to do that many laps. Oh god, Cornish Redeem Frontline Speed. Oh no. I don't want to say this so many times tonight. You're gonna have to. Oh god. I'll do Con it a couple of Con times. Con <laughs> there, there's the spirit. <laughs> What's Gunty gonna set? Fastest, 17 3. That did look tidy from Gunty. Alright, is Mr. Roberts on that? He's not out of that. Who's on? And lap on the mediums. I do not know. Storage. Oh god. Storage. Where's Mr. Storage? Do -do -do -do. There Queen is. intercepts do. Oh, we've got an alpha toy in front of him, which is Mr. Pigeon, doing three lap holds off, so he's obviously doing the bank strategy. Yeah, Cornish, I reckon you do. <laughs> yeah, Cornish, you should probably leave the pits, mate. <laughs> Storage has gone quickest, no surprise there, really. <laughs> right. This last sector is very tricky. I did it yesterday, and... Where storage is now, these these corners are a pain to get right. Yeah. You took you touch that yellow curb, either of them, your your Front car is going speed. sideways. 17-1. How would you rate that Ben? That frontline speed. <laughs> I didn't put enough energy into it. Let's see where rates you. Uh do, 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 do. who's that? Roberts, 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 Roberts. where's Ralph Roberts? Where is he? I cannot find him. There he is. Now, earlier on, I did get told Robert's setup got deleted, which wasn't ideal for the guy. So hopefully he's finally set up again and can get back onto the pace. Yeah. I didn't know about his setup being deleted. Yeah, I saw it in the Division 2 chat and... Um, yeah, it wasn't ideal for Roberts, but hopefully he's found himself again. Yeah, he posted it in Aston Martin right. chat, so it would be easy for him to make. Oh, there you go. He, he, he should know it then. It's a legend, has invalidated. What's Hudson doing? He's done his lights. Cornish coming out of the pits. Quick tails on that. Quick on that. Maybe perps. 27, 20, 27, 21, 6. Cornish, right, let them turn off the stream. Have a good one. Cheers, Cornish. Oh, that's a Martin going slow. I believe that's Gunty in sector one. Turkey Turtle, what's he going to do? 50 point. F Gun no, 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 it's Robert's sector one. Gunty goes faster, 17 0. You can do at least five laps on these mediums. Gunty was complaining about pace uh, a few days ago. <laughs> was he now? Oh. Come on, Gunty. <laughs> well, I'm expecting Paul from Gunty now, since you said that. 16-7, Jesus Christ. Was, wait, Koki Total was in Division 3 last season, I believe. Or was he? I'm not too sure. Oh, do -do -do -do. I, I'm not sure. I think he was. And he got promoted to Division 2. Yeah, must have. Legend's invalidated again. This ain't good looking good for Legend. He's having a rough time tonight. Roberts is starting another lap. What's Cornish Star looking like? Oh, Cornish is finally on a lap. 
Cornish, Mr. Pasta Man. Here he is. I've got no doubt of him. There it is. Let's see what Pasta Man can do. 21 nice, bat three attempts down on Quirk Turtle in Sector 1. Well, that's fine because Quirk Turtle is in another league of his own at the moment. He's got Haskin out of the way. I have noticed Cornish is taking a very tight inside for that corner. It's the first time I've watched him do a lap in this session, so I keep an eye on that. Williams on top says, a what? Oh god. Oh, 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 oh you invalid. Oh, Cornish. <laughs> Caesar is behind him. He's on a lap. Hopefully he didn't get hit by Cornish. I believe Cornish is going to be charging go again. Let's see what Mr. Caesar Wizard can set. Alpha Omega. Who's that off the track? Jesus. Going to be a tie, 17 0. Uh, yeah, I'm roughly safe. Yeah, it should be safe unless everyone just whacks on the softs. Which I highly doubt that will happen. Quirky can go off. He's a 72. Is Legends on a lap? He is. Legends is a 10th up on his 19 3. Jesus Christ, that was quick through there, Legends. What's Legends going to set? He's on his third lap. Second. Oh, what first? Oh, might not be safe here. I'm close. Yeah. To be fair, Robert might not, if Robert does get knocked out here, it won't be in a bad place because people have done two laps minimum on their mediums. The Cornet side is four. Yeah, Cornet star, if he gets through on them, he's going to be feeling the effect. So do Gunty. They're gonna, they will feel the effect after a couple of laps in the race. Legends will be High also on, in that situation. Oh, Cornish. Evening, Tomo. Ah, oh, evening, Tomo. Oh, Horizon! Oh, he's, oh how's he got over there? Another one into the 16s. Cornish. I've never seen anyone crash there. Oh, Cornish, past the man. Yeah, pitch, okay, pitch, 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 I do want to stand it. It can spin you out if you do go it the wrong way. Legends retires. Yeah, he's safe. Uh, Pigeon, let's, what's he do? Championship rival. P2, that will seem safe. Only 20,000 off Quirky who retires in the pit. Ben's is 10th Oh, never mind. Yeah, I, I don't see Roberts getting through, through to Q3 here. Yeah, neither. I think Cornet starts hoping gets knocked out as well because four lap old mediums is oh, not what he Ben's wants to be on. Yeah. Four lap old mediums. You you can pit around lap seven, eight on the hard and go to the end and it's still be in good condition, so it's not the end of the world. Cornish Cornish has crashed! Oh Cornish. He's, he's, Cornish! That's in the pits! That's in the pits! <laughs> Cornish! Oh, that's the man, he's done it again! He's crashed in the pits! No, oh, Cornish! <laughs> Cornish, what's happened, lad? Oh no, oh, he's going to the pit, please. Oh, where is he, where is he, where is he? Oh, his car disappeared. Oh, crazy fish has crashed! Oh no! In the pits? Oh my god, everyone! No, he just crashed going around the final corner. That might, that might have been what Cornish did, but just a bit earlier. Oh my god. Okay. Evo go. didn't make it through. So Corn will only have nine in Q3. Cornish. Oh Cornish. Cor you didn't need to go for another lap, Cornish. Uh, oh, tribal's here instead of uh biscuit. One try, um, what cost tribal then? Um, 
He's a reserve. Is he meant to be in here? He's a reserve. Oh, is he? I don't. Okay, I think he might be replacing Biscuit then. I think he's the second reserve. Oh yeah, I think he's replacing Mr. Biscuit tonight. Yeah, okay, yeah, one child was replacing Biscuit, okay, that's a call. Uh, let's read the chat here, what's it saying? Horizon lane bottom lane again, not su now, now su not surprised. Jesus, I didn't get my words right. Sliver and Cornish AI was in the way of fish then. Was he? I didn't see Cornish AI. Oh, there's a bit of wing in the pits. Who's crashed? Alright, so in Q2 we have Crooked Turtle set. I think he topped Q1, didn't he? Yeah, I think he did. My memory is so blank. <laughs> this piece is getting cold. <laughs> there we go, Q2 is finished. Oh, this call you is called very quick. It has. It really has. <laughs> so much drama. I think we've had five drivers crash out so far. Uh, yeah. Um, I think we have nice. Bison, both Red Bulls, Cornish, Cornish, Crazy Four. Fish. Yeah, quick. Yeah, five. All right. Crazy yeah, Fish. Crazy Fish. Yeah. I think Crazy Fish retired. Sure uh, yeah, 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 he crashed from straight, didn't he? Oh, yeah, okay, quickly before we get into Q3. Knocked out in Q2 is 14th is Horizon, who unfortunately crashed. 13th is Evo in the Ferrari. 12th is Crazy Fish in the Alpha Romeo. 11th is DP Bollocks. And crashing out at the end of the session is Mr. RSF1 Cornish, who will start in 10th. And leading the session was Quirk Turtle. Consciously, I was in the way of fish then. Um, uh, evening, honey. What, what's happening? <laughs> uh, tribal's loading. That's it. Have you got a black screen? Nah, I can see he's loading. It's tribal. I've got a black screen. Tribal's. Stop loading. Um. Is trouble still loading? Yeah. yeah. I think you might have to rejoin. Okay, I think it will fix itself if oh. trouble loads in. Everyone's. Oh, What's I think it's solid. Yeah, okay, there we go. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Yeah. Okay, fix itself. All good. I've got a black screen now. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> oh no, I'm in, I'm in. Oh god. Oh, no, I'm in, I'm in. Okay, good. <laughs> Ooh. Scary times. Alright. <laughs> yeah, it was scary times indeed. We have 9 in Q3, Mr. Invade and chat. Who are you picking for your pole position? Um, I'm probably going to go with... Qu Quicktail. Yeah, quirk, 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 Quirky Turtle, there we go, has been setting the pace in Q1 and Q2. I, didn't I know believe to Gunty, I think Gunty will, will snatch pole tonight. Yeah, I didn't know how to pick out him, Pigeon Munch, uh, Storage and Quirky. <laughs> Cornish, while well, I'm back quicker than expected. <laughs> I'm so annoyed I did that, I'm gonna be swamped by fresh mediums behind me now. <laughs> Uh, it's unfortunate, Cornish. Cornish. Oh, Williams 1 2, go to team. Oh, stop it. You can't be that go to, you're not leaving the overall constructors. Exactly. Speak, speak to Aston Martin first. <laughs> we only have one driver in this session, though. It's not bad starting outside top 10. It's actually. Oh no, frontline speed, pretty, are you serious? Pretty sure Robert's got, uh, got 11th anyway. It was like I'm doing a frontline speed for Cornish's sake, he just redeemed it. Oh god. 
Oh, here we go. Let's do an onboard, Mr. Pigeon Munch. Championship leader, nonetheless. Round the final corner. He's going to whack open that DOS down the front straight. He's going to get that front line speed. God, that's going to be a bad one. Stop. Okay. That's turn Number one. one. The inside curve. Ooh, on the limits right there. Oh, nicely done by Pigeon Munch. Will he go full throttle? No, lifts off a tiny bit. Make sure to go, don't go too wide. Oh, gets, oh, he's on the grass. Down to third. Take an inside line. Get the maximum time possible. Everyone's taking a wider line. Gonna go down to second here. Yeah, up to fourth. No, up to third. Why the outside curb? Sorry about that. Why the outside curb? Now, this curb, you wanna hit the apex. Apex, inside curb. Sorry about that. Now, this is where I've seen a lot of people lose the car because of twitchiness. Pigeon keeps in sick. Flat out almost. What's it gonna be? Do for sector two times? It's gonna be a 50.4. I think that's a couple tenths slower than Quick Turtle in Q1. Well, let's have a look. Pigeon has to correct the steering there, or else he would have spun the car. Right, the outside curve. Go down to third. Careful the yellow curve. They can half spin you. Oh, ride right, that inside curve on the final corner. Let's see what Pigeon's going to set. He's going to set a 116.5, which matches Quick Turtle in Q1, I believe. Yeah, one race is going to be next. 15-4. Legends, what's he going to do? Followed by Caesar. Two words is on on that lap. Legend does a 16-7. We have Mr. Gunty. Where are you? 16-9. Then we have the Haas, I believe. What, what is okay. What's Hudson doing? 50.4. I think that's quicker than Pigeon Munch. Goes third fastest. We have... Is that Mr. Sturridge? Or is that Mr. No. Crokey's invalidated. What about Cornet Star? Cornet Star's on all that. Let's see what he does here. Cornish, I'm pretty sure he said he would be Grunty. That's <laughs> Cornish. Obviously, I was going to be your favourite for Paul, yes, Bush. Who will you pick now? <laughs> Yes, you were going to be one of my favourite corners, but I'm going with Gunty now. You let me down. Uh, is Pigeon going again? I'm going with that ball in that Aston Martin, though. Oh, if Gun crashes now, I've got the commentator curse. Ben's boxing. See the two ways as well, you lad. There you are. The last person on the uh, in lap. Out lap, sorry. Second. 16-4. Legend's going again, what's he going to set? Does not improve, I don't believe. Gunty, where are you mate? He's going again. Okay. Quirky, have you been validated? No, you kept it valid, let's go. Let's see what you do now, Quirky Turtle. Careful of the curbs, they can spin you. Alright. See, will he go fastest like he did in Q1 and Q2? Quirk Turtle gonna cross the line. No. Ben. We have one racer has pulled something out of the bag. Caesar's on the lap. His legends. I think he's going again. Yeah. What's the sector two looking like? Only just up two thousandths. Here yellow flag, I think that's Caesar's who was just slowing down to that one pass. Legend's gonna box because he's got no more fuel, it's either set it, oh no, no, yeah, I think he's just lost all the time there. I'll be surprised if he improves. I wouldn't know about the flat this one. Oh my Jesus, Legends! Went wide on the final corner as well and still went fastest. <laughs> Legends, Legends, the one who almost got knocked, knocked out in Q1. Yeah, it's provisional. He struggled pole in Q1, then. and now suddenly he's sat on provisional, provisional pole. Oh, Ooh, I didn't know he was left. Oh, I didn't know he left. The, yeah, neither. Yeah, I didn't get notifications saying you left. I think that's first round done. Yep, everyone's. Have you seen what the camera put in chat? 
Who? Tom Lowe, he said the frontline speed was awful, put some effort in it. Well, Mr. Tomo, I am very sorry that I did not please your needs. <laughs> we all don't have the natural frontland speed in their voice. Ben's just too gifted. Is Pigeon going to get... Oh, Pigeon's out early. Okay. Oh, one Charles left. Can you get him back in, please? Yeah. Yeah, sure. Uh, I hope he doesn't miss it out on the race. Alright, Pigeon was five thousand up in sector one. He needs to find three tenths if you want to get near his championship rival, Mr. IGN Legends, who are very close. They are very good friends. They always sit and party together, so I'm pretty sure Legends will be trying to distract him. As Legends entering the pits right now, you'll have time, just needs to get in, get some tires on, get some fuel in. Pigeon, Pigeon two and a half yeah, two almost two and a half tenths up. This will put him around Legends actually. This final set doesn't look like. He's been buying that inside curb a lot. I don't know if it's helping him or not. Let's see what he sets. Is it faster? 16. Oh, can we get into the 15s? Will anyone? I reckon Legends of Ben will do it. I think ben will pull out of the hat. Mr. Hunt, good to hear. Hush back and cons. Thank you, Hunt. Been a while, I'm a bit busty, but hopefully as we progress into the season, I'll get back onto it. Um, okay, Charles back in, good stuff. Who, I think, okay, Mr. Hudson, 16-6. I can remember Hudson, he cheered on Mr. Coy Marshall last night in F1 Division, winning the race. He's going to hope to do similar fashion tonight, winning the Haskell. Yep. I'm a bit scared that the Hasses are winning races all of a sudden. I mean, they was doing that a lot in F5. With Aaron Bart. Yeah, Hass, I wouldn't surprise me if Hass put in the challenge right now. I mean, to be honest, Hass always get the quick reserves. <laughs> I don't, uh, don't think they have any reserves tonight then. Oh! oh! <laughs> Hudson! <laughs> Jesus. Season 2 where to school up. He... Oh, he's way out of the way. What is this camera oh, angle? Storage is left again. I'll try and get him back. He's got two minutes to get back in. Oh, hopefully he's not having connection issues. It'd be a shame if he misses out on the race. Uh, Hudson will have enough time for another lap, just got to recharge and go again. Oh my god. Oh, trial was left as well. Are we having connection issues? I don't think so. 16 1 from Wizard. Where's BF1? Oh, I think. Who's that band? Is that Cornet Saw? No, it's Cornet Saw. Yeah, it is Cornet Saw. Ben's invalidated. He'll have enough time for one more lap. So you don't need to panic with Quirky Turtle. Here he is. He's kept it battered. Let's see what he can do. Get yeah. oh, we're picking up a slipstream from Ben. What's his? He's almost two temps up. This will put him round IGN Legends, maybe higher if he gets more time in his final sector. Keeps him fourth. Does he ride these curves? I know a lot of people have. No, he avoids them. Oh, that's very smooth on the steering. Six. Oh, oh JJ Hudson so got some like, front line speed from that corner. Yeah, Quirk Turtle went fast. It's 16 0. We are so close to the 15s. I do hope someone gets into them. Yeah. Maybe Pigeon Munch. Uh, we have an out talk. I think Pigeon Munch. No, he's on an out lap. Pigeon does use a lot of set of, use a lot of set of softs, I've noticed. Yeah, I think he saved some. I don't think I think he used two in Q1 and two in Q3. I mean, I think you only get four together if you reach Q3. No, I'm pretty sure so, Grunt was the only one who used two sets. 
That's all. I'm pretty sure he is. Was he? I'm pretty sure. Um, Pigeon used two sets. No, I'm 100 sure it was just Grunt. Oh, I see. Quiet star. Oh no! Oh, we invalidated around the final corner. I ain't got double up. No, he hasn't. Never mind. Okay, hush my mouth. Legends is starting his lap. We have a four is Ben. This is his only lap. Can Ben do it? Can Ben be the one into the 15? Oh, Grunt! Oh, Grunt almost lost it. Ben come around the final corner. Will he be in 15? Will he be on pole? No! Oh, oh one foul! Oh, close! Oh, oh no! Ben's gonna be triggered. Oh my god. Oh no! I guarantee Legends Ben is having a few words in his party. Oh, Quiet Star is on a lap. Oh, Pigeon Munch. On a lap. Oh! Pigeon Munch can't even get into the 15s. Oh, we're not going to get 15, I don't think. Oh, wait, no. Unless Cornet Star pulls something out of the bag. Oh, come on, Cornet Star. Or Hudson. Star. No, Hudson's done. Yeah, Hudson's all down to done. Cornet Star. Will Cornet Star do it? Will he upset Quirky Turtle and get on professional pole? Can Cornets all do it? Can he get into the 15s? Can he get on the front row? Let's see. No. Oh my oh, god. That is really probably the closest pole position I've ever seen. One thousandth. Oh, Ben. That is insane. I I know Ben is going to be annoyed about that. Ben's going to be human. Right, there. Do you want to read us out the Q3 results, Invade? Because I'm going to um, go to the toilet real quick, if you don't mind. Alright, sure. In all right, P9, back. we have Storage in the Williams, didn't set a lap. P8, Grunty in the Aston Martin. 7th, we have Cornet Star in the Alpine. 6th, IGN Legends in the Merc. 5th, is JJ Hudson in the Haas. Fourth, CC2 Wizard in the Alpha Romeo. In the third, we have Pigeon Munch in the Alpha Terry. Second, we have BF1 Race in the Ferrari. And first place is Quirky Tail in the Williams. Wow, Quirky. Yep, 100%, Tomo. Grunt, don't worry, you're getting the win anyway. Oh, back in time, I see. <laughs> oh, someone ready to up early then. Yeah, hopefully the host call it so they get an appropriate penalty. Hopefully. Oh. Oh, what's happened here? Do you see another tower at the top of yours? Yes. I. Are we having lobby issues tonight? I really hope we're not. Maybe the service is playing up. Hopefully it starts. Come on, what was game? Oh, okay. Okay, do you want to take us through the formation lap, Mister Invade? Uh, yeah, sure. In twentieth, we have one tribal in the Alpine. Nineteenth, we have Eyes the Best in the McLaren. Eighteenth, we have Matty. In the Alpha Tari. 17th, we have One Shot in the Red Bull. 16th, we have Tornado in the Mercedes. 
We have 50 if we have CW in the Red Bull. Um, 14 if we have Horizon on the in the house. Also on the mediums, same with everyone behind them other than mine. Uh, 13 if we have SOR Evo on the mediums in the Ferrari. 12 if we have Crazy Fish in the Alpha Male on the mediums. 11 if we have Roberts in the Aston Martin on the mediums. RS I think Cornish is in 10th on the mediums. 9th we have Storage, storage in the Williams. In the, uh, on the mediums. Eighth, we have Grunty in the Aston Martin on the mediums. Seventh, we have Cornet Star in the Alpine in the medium on the mediums. Sixth, we have Legends in the Mercedes on the mediums. Fifth, we have JJ Hudson on in the Haas in on the mediums. Fourth, we have Caesar Two Wizard in the Alpha Romeo on the mediums. Third, we have Mr. Pigeon Munch. In the Alpha Tari, in the meet on the mediums, the F1 racer in the ha in not the half, uh, Ferrari on the mediums, and first place Craig Turtle on in the Williams on the mediums. Oh oh what oh my god what oh no oh no what oh no St what is this. Oh no, this is better not cause issues on... Oh, no. oh, this is going to cause a lot of issues. This better not cause issues. Wait, let me go from... Oh Cornish no, 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 no. Oh my god. What's happening? Oh. He's reversing. What? 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 Uh, <laughs> I left. What? I'll see you, And the lights are away we go for storage. <laughs> 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 Let's go <on> board. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> what? Down the turn one was doing, he takes the lead. <laughs> we're gonna be able to lobby the um, restart. I think we're gonna need a restart, guys. I've, if there's any admins in chat, can you let us know what's happening? Because I think we might need to do a restart. Uh, Cornish, Cornish, are you in chat still? Yeah, restart now. I think you? it's gonna need to be a restart. Is that we start? Yeah, Mills, he said. Alright, Chad Mills, if let us know. <laughs> oh, that was that that's meme review quality right there. <laughs> uh. Oh fantastic. I mean still you're still going mad. I feel bad for you because you 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 did that formation up so well as well. You got it perfectly on time. Yeah, I'm. I just kept messing up saying he's on the media. Um, he's in the media. Oh, I, I want to see what it's like when Storage come down the final corner. <laughs> oh, never mind. <laughs> he's just gonna turn into I, a I, bowling ball. Oh. oh. We are we alright. Let's do some TT while we wait, guys. You're gonna see how endless I am at Monaco. Monaco? Why are you doing Monaco? Oh, uh, do you want me to do Spain? Because Monaco was the next track. I can do. Yeah, okay, we'll yeah do, Spain. do Spain because we're commentating over Spain. <laughs> yeah, okay, that is true. I'll, I just thought you know Monaco's the next race. Trying to get some early packs in. <laughs> what do you mean? Oh god, this is gonna go horrendous. I had to pick up your own setup. <laughs> well, I'm there, so I may as well. <laughs> oh my Jesus Christ. Um, what are you doing? Ah, uh, <laughs> this is. Oh god. I think that's my set lens done. Let's see how I do. Oh no, everyone's gonna see how bad I am at driving. Why is my car so slow? I'm gonna spin. I'm just, I've turned on stream for this. Oh no. <laughs> I'm gonna do a little bit of commentating over it. Oh Jesus Christ. 
into turn one. Oh, you lost I did, it. I did give you a warning, I would spin. Oh, no. Oh, God. You're just showing everyone. Can you let me know when the lobby's ready, Spain. if you don't mind. Yeah, I'll invite you now. Just showing everyone oh. how to spin around Spain. This is why I'm not a big fan of Spain. It's an horrendous track. You stole off on oh. I'm doing Cornish proud. <laughs> oh no! How many penalties oh, do you reckon uh, Cornish will get this race? Oh, that's, I'm gonna go with twelve. I'm gonna go with twenty-one. Do you need another game invite? Oh no, I'll just, I just want a quickie step out of lap to show I'm not watched. Yeah. You know? Uh, at least you're not as washed as Easton. I mean, at least you got a podium. Better than I could do. Oh, that is not invalid, please. Oh, it's invalid again. Are you just concentrating now? <laughs> yes. <laughs> it's not like I'm actually on a quality lap right now. This is for this is for Paul. No, oh, don't stall. I I I am not the best at hand speed. Oh my Jesus! Again. I can see why I was avoiding that curb now. I mean, you haven't touched uh, the wall. Do one more, and then I'll join the lobby. You didn't even touch the wall somehow. Got low, so I went on three people in here. Exactly, hun, an F1 uh, driver. God, what they're saying? Saying, uh, hun, but an F1 driver, ladies and gentlemen. I love you know this F1 driver's got winter his name this season. <laughs> I'm not that bad. Max ABS. We move, we move. <laughs> Turn off the ABS seat, see how you really do. Oh god no. You've been touching your ass a little bit. I'm busty. You had a race yesterday, how can you be rusty? <laughs> you drove around this track for the 33 laps. Let's see how it compares to everyone else, oh god. There we go. We all delight. That would have been a 15 in TT. Oh god. Yeah, that would even have got you pulling today. Yeah, I get it, I get it. Don't make fun of me, guys. Alright, I'll join now. F1 driver. Alright, Hun. Hun, no need for that. I mean, I haven't even set a time trial around here. I'm not sure I can go quicker than that. I did on last game. I'm glad I didn't do Monaco now. Alright. I think they'll be sending a good right now. Who's that host? It's Mr. DP Roberts. Hans is faster than you. Can you understand the message, Josh? I do not understand, no. <laughs> uh. Okay. 
we are we have 20 drive yeah Ryzen we're waiting on Ryzen's in the wood pass we are waiting on an alpine of Mr. Biscuit who should be one tribal yeah one tribal yeah one tribal Starting last, then you know. Yeah, he is. The sooner more trouble gets in, the sooner we can get this underway. I know ben, Ben's being thankful. I can remember we put in the chat earlier. His tire tank is thirty-three laps around here, right? Yes, thirty-three. I've done sixty laps of comms around here, and then tomorrow I'm doing another thirty-three racing. You just love Spain. Yeah, must do. I don't know, one time I was in the lobby. Oh, wait, what? He's just oh, not chosen a car guest. Wait, 20 drivers left. I don't think we did. Wait, why is he in the Red Bull? Yeah, I'm confused now. It wasn't one shot in the Red Bull. Red tw Yeah, wait, yeah, it was one sh Wait, no, what? Yeah, I'm one shot was in the Red Bull. Yeah, well, oh yeah, he was in a little bit. Wait, but yeah, where's one shot? Oh yeah, one shot's not here. That's who we're waiting on. I don't think, I, I don't think he'd be joining back though. By the looks of things. Yeah, but shouldn't he go into the Alpine? At least. I think because originally Red Bull had two drivers, so... One child of vision being the Alpine, so it makes more sense, is what I'm trying to guess from this. It makes sense after all. Right, as soon as he goes Alpine, I think we're underway, so we just need to wait for Tribal to get in the Alpine. Oh, that will. What did he say? Go check the chat. He's trying to speak to you. Yo, hush, what do you mean? <laughs> uh, Hunt says visual for comms performance is fine. Thank you, Hunt. Oh, let me stress this, guys. Do not forget your setups. Please. And same tyres you was on. Yeah, so you will... You If you don't pick the same tyres, you will need to pick lap one. Otherwise, you will be facing a penalty. I'm great, Vettel, how are you? And hello, Ghastly. Oh god, make sure that frontline speed is awesome. Oh, oh god. I hate corners. Mm. Well, he had to make that frontline speed, I think, didn't he? Everyone in the top 10 will be on the uh, mediums, I believe, so, yeah. Everyone else can start on what tire they want. Right, let's call it still. Hopefully, storage has no issue this time. Fell, you, you better watch the whole race. Come on, push. Give us passion and aggression. <laughs> Even if you pick that one, doesn't matter. No, I'm pretty sure it is in the rule book. Unless I'm. Alright, let's have a look here. Who's on the mediums? Everyone is on the medium. Good stuff. We have Tribal Nile. I mean, Corners going to be happy now because he was worried he was going to get swarmed at the start on four lap hold mediums. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you better win at Monaco, you know. I just hope no one forgets their setups. 
Good man. How many hours did you do yesterday after the race? Don't get him started. He's, he's going to go on a rant how he's going to bottle with Monaco. I've raced with Vettel for six seasons now in RSF1 and he's bottled Monaco ever since. Wait, you've been in since the start then? Yeah, I've been in RSF1 since the first race. Yeah, I have not. I've, I joined the end of season three. Yeah, I've seen my fair share of incidents over the six seasons. I've seen some crazy incidents in this in this league. Me and Hush are the true OGs. Yes, we are battle. We are the true OGs of the RSF one. All right, ten seconds. Hopefully, no one's forgot their setups and everyone's looking like the start on mediums. So we you want invade, to talk like you're... again. May as well invade. Go on. Give, give us some passion. Oh. <laughs> you don't need to say right. the tires because I think everyone's on mediums. 19th. We have one tribal in the Alpine on the mediums. 18th. We have as the best in the McLaren on the mediums. 17th. We have Matty in the Alpine. Uh, Alphatari on the hards. Oh. Uh, 16th we have Tornado in the Mercedes on the mediums. 15th we have CW in the Red Bull on the mediums. 14th we have Horizon in the Haas on the mediums. 13th we have Evo in the Ferrari on the mediums. 12th we have Crazy Fish in the Alfa Romeo on the mediums. 11th we have Roberts in the Aston Martin on the mediums. 10th we have Cornish in the McLaren on the mediums. 9th we have Storage in the Williams on the mediums. 8th we have Grunty in the Aston Martin on the mediums. 7th we have Cornet Star in the Alpine on the mediums. JJ, uh, wait, no. Safe, we have Legends in the Mercedes on the mediums. Fifth, we have JJ Hudson in the Haas on the mediums. Fourth, we have Caesar T Wizard in the Alpha Romeo on the mediums. Third, we have Mr. Pigeon Munch in the Alpha Tari on the mediums. Second, we have BF1 Racer in the Ferrari on the mediums. And first place is Quirky Tail or in the Alpine. Oh, no, in the Williams and on the and on the mediums. You can't tell if it's the Alpine or the Williams, can you? Yeah, you, you yeah you can't. Uh, Cornish and Roberts will be swamped at the start. They have cold tires. Same with the best and more try, but they're at the back, so no issue there. So Short bell. What's he saying now? Invade about to fall asleep. <laughs> it's classic bell. Alright, no issues. Okay, here we go. Five, four, three. Two, give me a good angle. One. Lights out and away we go. I think Ben gets a good start. Yes, he does alongside. Oh, we've got Quirk Tokadol. He's going to go side by side with Ben. It's the first one. Pigeon Munch trying to get his nose involved. Oh, no. Don't go too wide. Oh, God. Three wide. VF1 takes the lead. We've got Mercedes trying to get on the inside. Oh, no. We've got McLaren at the back. Oh, no, 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 no. Caesar. Oh, God. <laughs> Caesar, Caesar, oh, we've got both oh, Alphas, Cornish. both Alphas Cornish around. Cornish on the outside. We have both Alpha Romeo's around, Cornish is attacking CW. Oh, both oh, passes them, no, side by side. Oh, oh no. the Red Bulls oh, out. Oh, no, CW, oh, oh no. That's oh, good. Ben's left, going, Ben's left, can you get back in? going like four wide. Can you get ben back, ben back in quickly? It's a virtual safety car. Oh, wait. Ben disconnected. Yeah, I just saw he'd have to session, so this might help Ben. Hopefully he doesn't lose the lead. So a crazy first lap. Ben takes the lead. We have CW getting. Uh, I don't know. CW hit the wall. Sorry. Both alphas get spun out. Those going three wide. 
There's nothing no, he could do, that. really. Have damage, he would do that. Yeah. Everyone's good for damage wise. Ben, it's Ben back in, let's have a look. Yeah, he is. Ben, he's still got That's Aaron There we go, he's back in. Yeah, he's back in, he's back in. Lovely stuff. That virtual stage quite helped, Ben. We've got the two championship leaders next to one another. That's going to be an interesting duel. Pretty much one with ties up. Also, I was looking like. Tornado's in. Is this for damage? Tornado's Or is he going to pass to the end? Lose that many, many places, you know. Yeah, Tornado's got damage. Um, Just saying, Matty and Eyes both gone up five positions. Caesar 2. Oh! oh, oh in what pass? the? Oh, Rob, no. That oh, is so unfortunate for Roberts. No, Roberts. No. Oh, that is so unfortunate for Roberts. Oh, does he even have a wing anymore? No, he's lucky to still be in the race. Oh, that is so unfortunate for you, Roberts. Oh. You gotta feel bad for him. Yeah, but I'm, I'm gonna have to get back to the front, so. Oh, very unfortunate for oh, you there, Roberts. A car completely off. Matty is just. Forgot how to break. We've got a DRS train, then we've got a gap to Horizon. Uh, we've got a gap to Matty, who's three seconds away from Horizon. Been attacked by Eyes the best. All IGN legends looking very close indeed to Mr. Quirk Turtle. Mr. Pigeon's jumped Quirk Turtle, I just realised. Nice. Okay, here we go. Oh, no. What are you oh, saying? No. Another virtual safety car. No, oh, that's the Evo who's crashed. Um, Quirky, why did you just overtake everyone? A bit weird. Roberts has finally got into the pits. Oh, is he going hard? Hards can go to the end. Yeah, yeah, he'll have to, won't he? It, it's just better if you go for the hards here, Roberts. They can go to the end. Oh, Ben! Five seconds. Oh no! That no 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 no. Oh, ben. I think I that I don't think that's Ben swapping. That's because Quirk Turtle overtook him under the virtual safety car. What in that uh, safety car glitch? I think so. I think that's what gave him the penalty. I thought they would remove that. So unfortunately, Ben can't get that penalty removed. He's gonna have to serve it in the pit, so he's got to break away for five seconds. It's not going to be easy because then how close this field is. Yeah. Wow. Oh, interesting three laps there. Invade. Two virtual safety cars and three crashes. That's already double the safety cars that were uh, last night. <laughs> yes. We didn't get a single VSD or safety car last night. Alright. Lights out and away we go. Back on the way. <laughs> I don't know why I said lights up. Here we go. Mr. Pidgemunch. Oh. Eyes oh, Ben's gone right wide. on Matty. Oh, there we go. Pigeon. Pigeon. Ben's going to be under attack from Pigeon here. Oh, look at that speed. Look at the speed. Oh, Ben. Ben. Yeah, he's going to stay in behind. Oh, what's happening behind? Oh, yeah, Horizon's in a gaming. Train. Not gaining enough on Cornish. No. Oh, and I just oh. spun. Ah. Where they both, where both Red Bulls crashed out. Yes, uh, no need to rub it in. <laughs> <laughs> I just had to say. <laughs> yes. Looks like the, um, the front two are breaking away from Quirk Turtle here. Oh, Matty. I best gets underway again. Yep. Quirk Turtle's nine tenths behind, eight tenths now. He needs to get back in that DRS zone. Lovely stuff. We got the front nine in a DRS zone, and then we have a two second gap to see the two weather. So, not the hard one of Matty. He's going for that medium soft, hard soft, I mean. Hey, King Tomo. No, he won't. It's a glitch. Okay, we'll go to a game. Yes. 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 Exactly. It's been four laps and Cornish hasn't had a pen. He might have two warnings for his name, we don't know. 
I'm gonna have a nosebleed if he, if he survives 10 laps. If Cornish goes the whole way without no penalties, oh, I will Corn change my uh, crazy fish. username to Cornish's King. Yeah, two alphas battling side by side. The new team principal starts off in. It's going to be loving life. They're in the, they're in the points. Well, one of them. I the best in the pits. Yeah, you know what I mean. In the points. It's still a point at the end of the day. Pigeon is pulling ever so far ahead. Mm. Look at this. Oh, the legend is right on the gearbox. Look at this. He's pushing him through the corners. Look no, at no, that no, DRS no, train. Not, 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 okay. Yeah. There's nothing like that yesterday. Look at, this, look at the speed. Legend's getting... Surely he's going to have him down here. Well, Quirk's Kirk, got DRS. Legend's going to use that DRS. Quirk ain't going to fire, I don't think. It's going to let like, Legend's past. Quirky fire it. No, he lets Legend pass. Legend now gets after Mr. BF1 Racer and Mr. Pigeon Munch. Oh, Ben. That's new child limit, so I've seen one. <laughs> Cornet starts right on the map of thing, uh, thingy. Uh, Quirky turtle. He's flying the grass. Oh, oh, oh Cornet, no. no, please, okay. Oh, he's in the race. Wait, wait, Cornet, please. Cornet, wait, Cornet, wait. Oh my god. That could have ended badly. Very bad. He was lucky, crazy fish, and avoided him. Cornish. I don't know what's happened to Quirky here. He was setting the pace in Q1 and Q2, but ever since Q3, he's not had the pace. Oh, Cornish has to. He's really yeah. struggling. I'm surprised. Seven laps. Cornish hasn't got a penalty. I think they, I think he's actually concentrating on not getting a pen. Lives up the Williams. One at start, or is he retired? Yeah, yeah. Poor dead eight. He the probably could, he probably could have gone back into the race as well. Oh, the first one for track limits, Matty. Yeah, Mr. Matty in the Alpha Toy. See, with the all in the DRS train, so it's going to be hard for someone to make a move unless they get off a good one. This is a bit boring now, it's in a DRS train now. <laughs> oh, Cornish! What's happened to Cornish? I almost lost it, going uphill. Yep, Cornish uh, winning that pink helmet in tribute for Shrimper. We miss you, buddy. Cornish is getting ever closer to storage. CW's left, he's retired, so that's all dandy. Quirky Turtle is now outside DRS. He hasn't got DRS. Grunt's gaining. He won't gain enough though. Oh. Top four separated by five temps. Legends got the speed on Ben. What's the US looking like? Pigeon's got the least. Legend, look at Legend, he's right behind Ben. He's practically pushing him. Roberts has his lap 19 1, currently in 13th place, hoping for a safety car. We have a oh. spin, that's a Mercedes tornado. tornado, I believe. Yeah. Loads of people are spinning out there. Yeah, it's, it's a hard corner. If you get turn 2, you need to ride turn 2. If you don't ride it, you will spin. You either yeah. ride it or you avoid it. I think I might just avoid it. Yeah. <laughs> Avoiding it's better than taking a risk. 
Yeah, I suggest the rest of the drivers do if if they want to actually stay in front. Imagine you've got 100% the US and oh, you're just cruising I behind. I thought Cornish would have had a pen there. He's doing well, bless him. <laughs> Nine laps. Oh, Horizon's around. Oh no, oh no. Please, not in the wall, not in the wall. Oh my goodness. Who spun? Oh, Horizon. Same crazy, turn. Crazy. Yeah, same turn, but he avoids the wall. So I might oh. go crazy first. You need to let this go. You've got, you got hot tyres, Horizon. Oh, Legends. Oh, I missed a pass. Really pass. There we go. Oh, Legends gets past Ben. Yeah, Legends has got some speed on him tonight. Oh, Cornish just dropped know, out of DRS. I know Hunt's going to be happy about this. Now the front two, or now the front two in the championship. This is going to get very spicy. I think Pigeon's leading Legends by four points. Um, yeah, pretty sure. Yeah, uh, so this is going to be very hard and aggressive racing. They're going to make him move corners outside the DRS, but he's the last one in the train, so he's all fine. Don't need to worry about oh, that. Horizon ben. boxes. Ben. Sits behind. Has the Horizon got damage? I don't think he did. Tornado's on the back of Roberts now. I think he'd pay for a new set of mediums. I'm surprised he didn't go for hearts. Oh, Tornado's got him here. Yeah. Unty, three second time penalty. Yeah, Tornado got him way before turn one. I think Bobbitt's just playing a long game here. He just knows fighting ain't going to help the situation. What? Just DRS uh, share each other? Yeah, it's better off doing wrestling each other than just fighting, because then at least you're getting ground on um, Horizon. Yeah, fair enough. Is anyone close for a move? Gunty, looking very close to Quirky, he's looking very close to Ben. The storage is also Gunty looking is close. Closest. Yes. Are they gaining? Not enough. Oh, Robert's got to... went back by. <laughs> I think they might just be DRSing each other. Yeah, Robert's for the main straight uh, tornado for that short one. Pen situation, okay. I got you. Uh, I, I am. I know it's a long time to bear with me. There we go. Yeah, five seconds for Ben, he'll survey his next pit stop. Got three seconds for Bunty, Matty, and Horizon. Who, had, who else got that five second pen? Oh, and. Uh, it was oh, Cornette Tornado. Stop, but he pits, didn't he? Oh, Torn Tornado couldn't get past Roberts, turn one. I don't think they right, are. This is they where. Are, seen. are they not? That's a strange one. Even though Roberts' light is going off now. 6% ERS at one point. It is a track where you can gain 10% ERS back a lap, so it's not like you'll be down on power. But I want lap 12 now, this is where the pit stops are. If you're going to go hard, you roughly pit around lap 10 to 15. I really doubt anyone's going to stretch these me into softs. I do not see it. I mean, the cord. Muddy biscuit Soss, did like, last night. Yeah, sauce are good for like four laps, and then after that you just drop off, drop off the pace. Yeah. I think hard is the best solution in the end. Because not only will we, will we get them to cut on the soft runners, you'll they'll also have to be able to overtake you. I'm gonna take pens off. You don't mind, Mister? Come on. Yes, hunt. Tornado three second time penalty. He joins the penalty club. I am very surprised Cornish has not joined that club yet. 
It's been 12 laps. Could, could this be the race? Oh, tornado! Tornado lost his wing. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Going well for one Mercedes driver, going bad for the other. Oh no. Oh, and. Oh, every time. Every time I go off the battle for the lead, something happens. <laughs> oh, storage goes past court. No, storage and Cornish get past Grum. Legend's using his ERS, he doesn't want Legend overtaking him. And since six tenths that quick, Turtles just got back in the US zone. So it's Cornish. Matty on the hard is eight seconds back. So a late save to Cobble will bring Matty into things. If all these pit for hards. We also bring as the best tornado, one travel, and Roberts back in. Ooh, Eyes got penalty. 16 seconds back on the nearest car. So you really need a safety car to bring him back in things. Legends, on your brand, has got 94% of the US. Pigeon's got 40% of the US. Chadwick, Ben, my TP. Oh, Ben is now to the outside, DRS. Oh, Benjamin. He needs to get back in. He needs to get back in. Will he's he get back it? in. Oh, he's boxing. They're boxing. Legends are staying out. Oh, what? What? What's up, Pigeon? Pigeon? So no, please, someone box. Someone box. Oh, what's that? Has he crashed? But there's no yellow flags. Like, what? 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 His car's not there. What? Usually, if you're tired in the pitch, your car's still there. He's just vanished. Why would he even retire in the pits? I don't think he did retire, but he's just vanished. Oh, one what? travel spawn, by the way. Oh no, I don't think. Oh no. What? I'm actually that dead is confused. confusing. Why would he retire if he was leading the race? I mean, if he retired, that's, that's a strange one. Unless it's emergency, which we can understand. Yeah. Well, I don't understand. I, we didn't see him crashing the pit lane. <laughs> we didn't see no yellow flags. Yeah, I'm going to check is, this director. Is... Yeah, let's see if we've got any terminal damage. Legends box. There's, no not there's nothing here for a uh, pigeon. What? Oh, there isn't. Oh yeah, Ben third is fast second penalty, so he's, so Legend is going to come out in the lead. Just, just, just going to say, Cornish has two warnings, and he got his first one on lap one. Because of pigeon retirement, this has given Legends a lead of three seconds. Almost four. I, oh. All right. If anyone else is going to go hard, they will be pitting this lap. Otherwise, they will be stretching to the soft. Hmm. Cornish is gaining on Quirky. He ain't got penalty, so he's looking good for Cornish at the moment. Keep it clean. Got Chadwick, um, Ben had a five second pen. They had to serve. Yeah, he's probably a BSC glitch early on. Quirky's in, it's Cornish boxing. Cornish stays out, I think he's going for the softs. Yeah, it's like the, like the front three are going to go stretch out for the softs, I believe. Legend's gonna come out in fourth. All Legends need to do is keep it clean and he's got this race. What's happened? 
and we're just going to be joining behind storage. He's ahead of Matty, he needs to get ahead of Matty. Yeah. With Matty picking up another three second penalty. I think that's six. six seconds for him. Yeah. We're in that period of the race where we have gaps. Uh, Supposedly, yeah, uh, had Ben had wing damage from Pigeon. Oh, is that why he was struggling for pace? So apparently, Pigeon crashed. I don't think he. I didn't see no yellow flags. So I don't know if. It's a weird one. Yeah, very weird. Robert's getting a 3 second time penalty in 11 so you're going to need to pit again, he can't go to the end of mediums because he started on him. We have a McLaren round, is that I? He's, he's got no wing. And he's about to get lapped. By I his teammate. Alright, lovely stuff for Ice, keeping out of the way, good stuff from me. Um, not going to be any battles going on right now. Clubs. Oh really? It's more than a second gap between everyone. Uh, that's Eyes slowing down, I believe. Yes. I won't even be surprised if Eyes just goes in and retires. Yeah, once you get lapped on this game, you can't lap yourself. No matter what. Unless people are generous and let you pass. This very struggling with that wing damage. It's not been a great race for eyes. Let's hope his teammate can salvage some points on the Clavin team or the Tango machine, whichever you want to call it. The teammate who hasn't botched yet and somehow no pens. I think Cornish has been working on his penalties. He did say at the start of the he wants to work on him. Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, he's hunched and retiring now. Yeah, I think oh, he's calling it a day. Yeah, he's calling it a day. Five seconds for corner coin. Unbelievable. He's doing stuff a session. Fast his face up, we will need a safety car. <laughs> that'll be if we get a safety car, Cornish and the Alphas are in the money. Yep. Wait, is it Iso Tire? Wait. Is Eyes like isn't retiring. That's a weird one. What? I would 100% expect him to retire. In the whole field's I mean, now lapped in. I mean, pound. Got 13 seconds worth of I think Tornado's been lapped as well now. Alright, so for my calculations, these mediums right now. Oh, Caesar's in. For my calculation, these mediums would be on roughly 60%. Or 65. 60 so they will need 70. To pit. They will need to pit within the next four laps. Although, I think puncture territory is 75%. Cornish is pulling from crazy, to be honest. I think what Cornish is going to hope here is that Crazy Fish gets gets cashed and holds Legends up. Oh, could uh, Caesar come out ahead of half? Yeah, he does. Yeah, comfortably does. Comes out in P not P8. With penalties in front of Gunty and Matty. Obviously, Matty needs to pit again. So we're just keeping that 1.8, 1.9 second gap to Quirky. That's good stuff from him. Let's see if Cornish pits this lap. That's we don't get power to go on him. Is he pitting? Is he staying out? No, nope, staying out. Okay, he's committing to the softs. Fair play to Cornish, you know. 
I thought he would get 21 seconds, but he's on zero by lap 20. You say this, if he picks up a penalty, they'll just keep coming in like flies. Yeah. As soon as one comes, you'll get like 10. Oh, Ben's Caesar. getting closer. Oh, Matty's in. Matty's in. Who is? Ben's getting closer to Horizon back time. Yeah, the gap is now 1.6. Obviously, Ben had a five second penalty, so that did not help him. And he had one damage. 1.3 now. Legend is catching crazy fish, but I think crazy fish will be bogged in the next couple of laps, so I don't really need to worry about that. Point six. He's he's gaining, but he's also losing. See the way up. Storage has got it down to one point five to quirky. Yeah. Uh, it's Wait, not are these really. two teammates. Oh, yeah, they are. Legends. Okay. Yeah, uh, I think Quan is going to be hoping that Crazy Fish holds Legends up here. If it doesn't, yeah, okay. Legend I'm doesn't need to push this. I don't think he will defend much. Legend doesn't need to like, rush this over to He's got a fast second gap to the car behind. But he doesn't need to rush. Take your time. And he doesn't have to worry about Cornish pulling away much. Yeah. But the, as soon as he casts Crazy Fish, he'll start gaining all the fresh tyres. Yeah. Will Crazy Fish let him pass, or will he fight? Mm. Oh, that's, yeah. He's get, I don't think Crazy Fish is going to be holding this position anytime soon. Yeah, this yeah, is he's got the gearbox. Look at the grip he's got. Crazy Fish is, is, is small. He's not going to fight this. Crazy Fish should box this lap now. We've oh, got spin. one try Bible. Yeah, it's Cornish pin. No. How far is he taking these mediums? To be honest, I'm pretty sure Muddy Biscuit took him, took him about 25 laps. I think he was on. No. Yeah, okay, yeah, he was on fresh ones. I think he got no tank you too. So, yeah. I don't think that'll be possible on warm mediums. Horizon's in on 10 left old mediums, he's gonna go softs, I assume. And Ben gets pie. Yep. Now he puts his target on Caesar 2 Wizard. 5.1 second gap, let's see what he can do in that final 10 laps. It looks like he's got the pace. Roberts might not even be softs. able to get to the end, you know. I think he stopped on mediums. He has to pick again. Yeah. He's probably this is why win. I suggested hards, because if he had went hard, he yeah. probably would have gone to the end. I mean, probably would be higher. I don't think he'll be high, I think he'll be in the same position, but yeah, he'll have that comfort. Nah, I reckon he'll be probably near Ben if he was on the hards. Orange is in. About time. Let's hope he doesn't start the hards. <laughs> oh, imagine. Alright, soft tyres. I assume crazy, crazy, no, crazy staying out. Let's see where Cornish rejoins. I don't know why crazy staying out, to be honest. He should be ahead of Caesar 2 Wizard. Yeah, miles ahead of Caesar. He's out ahead of Gruntio. Okay, here we go. He oh. now, on fresh tyres, 10, lap, 10 laps ago, soft tyres, he can now chase after the two Williams. If Cornish keeps this clean, He's on for a P2. Yeah. All Cornish needs to do is avoid track limits, keep these tires alive, he's on for a P2 as all. But at the same time, he doesn't want to burn these tires out. Or get a pen. Let's hope he doesn't come to that. <laughs> I 
I, I, I assume storage won't fight this. Yeah. Probably not. Um, yeah, when I went on the soft yesterday, I think after four laps, I was on 18%. Jeez. Yeah. So I think around 10 laps, you'll be on 40. Crazy then. I assume storage will be zooming past the Williams. Storage, storage. Cornish, is in the US, he is. Oh, here we are, Cornish. So the outside? No, storage, storage is defending. Nice, got it. And concedes. Now go. Next up, Quetel. Cornish can keep these tires in good shape. He could, just could, spoil Legends Day. Oh, that would be a shame if he does. I know Hunt won't be happy if that happens. Well, Cornish got no pen, that's 100% cap. Pens, please, from Mr. Tomo. There you go. By the way, Vettel, he has got two warnings. Hashtag Vict. <laughs> he, he, he's your team principal, Bell. He's rigged the game. Alright. As soon as Cornish gets past, soon he can put a charge on for Legends. It's quirky, gonna fight this. Ooh. Cornish has to slap 17 to 6. He's, he's got the pace. He zooms past the Williams in 9p2. Everyone's in the chat, it's so shocked, he's got no pens. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Robert's no three second penalty, he's on six and he needs to play again, I believe. Hasn't been one of the best races for Robert, same that he got P2 last week. Yeah, it just shows how momentum can swing from one way to another. No one's going to have a perfect season. You'll always have that one race that goes against you, no matter how consistent you are. Yeah. It's just how league racing goes. Or you just me who's not consistent at all. <laughs> you got people who've got pace, but not much consistency, and then you've got the other way around. You've got consistency, but not much pace. Yeah. At the end of the day, it's not pace that wins your races and championships, it's consistency. It won't In the last lap, Cornish has pulled a second out of Legends. If I was Mr. Hunt, I'll be sweating. He did Hunt put in the chat, to be honest, if Cornish uh, wins on this strat and no pens, he will be happy with second. I'm not sweating. <laughs> Muddy, we're all as cute. Uh, we're all as confused as you are. <laughs> Three laps soft. Uh, oh yeah, sorry about the tires. There you go. On team principal here. <laughs> there is a few team principals racing tonight. Yeah, you've got Cornish, you've got Roberts, you've got Ben, and you've got Cornette Star. You've got four team principals out of the ten in this race. And one's DNF. Yeah, unfortunately. If Pigeon didn't retire, where would he be right now? That was my question. I reckon he would be in first or second. I feel like if Pigeon didn't retire and Legend and him fought out, Corner should be right behind him right now. Yeah. Gap is now three seconds, Legends. The gap's not. He's not gaining as much now. I think he's took the life yeah. out of his tyres now. It's like I said, once four laps have gone, the performance difference starts evening out. Is all his teammate ahead of him? Mate, will his teammate help him out and give him some cheeky DRS on the street? 
Yeah, he could, oh, no, he he could aside. do that all. Oh, pal, don't say that. <laughs> it would be funny. He, he, he's, he's drove a, Connors drove a good race. Alright, he doesn't deserve a penalty now. I'd laugh if he does, though. Curry the fish on the back of BF1 Racer. I don't see Ben staying ahead for much longer. Ben let him pass? No. Yeah, he, prob he probably did, uh, Muddy. Five laps to go. Yeah, only two virtual safety cars, no safety car. Maybe that'll be the trend this week, no safety cars. All of yeah, just all the weave. you have Division 5 up next. Here comes Crazy Fish on Ben. What's the defence like from Ben? Gonna keep the inside! Oh, holds Crazy Fish behind, good defence on Ben. He opened up the steering as Ben says. <laughs> Meanwhile, Cornish is now only two seconds behind. Cornish has driven this brilliantly. Oh! Where did he st he started P9, I'm pretty sure. Oh! Yeah, he did. No, he started P10. Crashed in Q2. Yeah. position. In a while. Oh, who's that? One tribal oh, spawn. One tribal. Uh, oh, one tribal. You guys, you guys. Oh, no, it's Cornish, never mind. I I could finally get an overtake on one tribal. Uh no. Cornish 1.9. Could Cornish pull off a superb race? One, I wouldn't say Legend has this just yet. It's now 1.8. 1.9. Ben and Fate. Crazy fish again. Oh, Ben, no. Ben. Oh, I hope there wasn't ball contact. Job. I'm hoping there wasn't contact. That's yeah. unfortunate for Ben. Wing damage. <laughs> Hashtag like what? Now this. Oh, Vettel. Who, who's, who do you, oh, do you want Legend? Sorry, sorry, it's I didn't see you coming. Ben washed. It's a 35% Slytherin. One point eight. Hey, got similar to your ass. If one of these get a penalty now, nah, that's sealed the deal. Three laps to go. Oh, Cornish! No, Cornish! Cornish! <laughs> no! Cornish! Oh, no! Cornish! Oh. He's got no damage, I he get, so I do reckon he can. Maybe get P3 again? Never mind. Oh Come on, Grom. I've, I've got no words. <laughs> oh, no. <gasps> oh, my God. Oh, my Cornish. God. What the hell? What? what? Have I just seen? what? Oh, my God. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> it's the last time sh it's the last time sh shoot out. Oh, no. Oh, no. No. <laughs> Oh no, Gunty, I feel so bad. Cornish is the second week in a row that you've killed someone. Oh no. Cornish. <laughs> Poor Gunty. <laughs> Never mind, Legend stay out, Legend, Legend stays out. Oh, Legend, you're done, mate. Why is no one boxing? Oh, if you don't Fresh box, will be miles you're quicker. stupid. If you Fresh don't box, you're quicker. stupid. No one's boxing. Oh, they're all stupid. 
first shot will be two seconds quicker. Ben, please pit, please. Okay, Ben's in. I expect everyone behind Ben to pit for first off. It's two weeks in no. a row for Corner. She's killed two people. Wait, who did? Wait, what happened last week with Corner? He killed uh, a Williams. So I just feel so bad for Gunty. He was a bystander and all that. Yeah. Didn't one tribal uh, DNF from it as well? well actually, uh, no, I think no. he crashed it last time. He got damage from it, I'm pretty sure, because I'm pretty sure they made contact. Oh, Cornish drove such a good race. Oh, Cornish. Safety car in the slap. Don't talk about what Cornish did in the chat, guys. <laughs> Leave it to the stewards. Yeah, it's gonna be a two-lap shootout. Well, yeah. Honestly, if Crazy Fish can catch up in time, um, he's got this. What's happening here? Yeah, Crazy Fish is in the money. Oh no, he's got that. Oh, he's got a stupid glitch where it makes you slow down. Oh, don't Crazy worry, he's got top. Wait, oh, will, no, will Eyes no. even beat Cornish? Uh, you just, yeah, just. Well, what is happening? What is Tornado doing? All oh, right, yeah. Gone board the restart. Tornado is tenth. I don't matter about it. Oh, oh, <laughs> legends! Legends! <laughs> legends! <laughs> Wait, Roberts! <laughs> Roberts is P6. Oh my god! Oh, it's free wide. wide. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my! There's god. contact. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> what has his face turned into? Oh, crazy fish down the inside of his tummy. Oh, crazy. Crazy needs to get a move on. He can win this race, crazy can. Oh, he's, oh, oh, he's, gonna, he's gonna go for it. Come on, crazy, get it past him. <sighs> what a move. Oh my god, crazy can win this. Crazy fish can win this race. <laughs> Come on, crazy fish. Crazy's on a charge. Look at, oh, look at Robbins. Yeah, he got a five second penalty, but I'm pretty sure that'll be... Oh, no. Please save that wasn't Robert's wing damage. Oh, it was. Oh, no. He got past Caesar, though. Yeah, but he's got wing damage. Oh, oh you got to feel bad for the Mercedes. Of legends. He's got on the... Oh! Oh, that was just fine. Crazy needs to clear horizon now. If Crazy wants to win, he needs to get past him. He's gonna get in. Crazy, you Ten. must send it. You must send it, Crazy. Ten laps versus one lap. Oh, horizon, don't fight it. You got a penalty. Roberts retires. Unfortunate for Roberts. Oh my god. Crazy. Oh my god. The charge is on. Crazy fish. One lap sauce. Versus quirky, 16 lap medium odds. The overall constructing, the constructors uh, leaders are not scoring. Qu Crazy Fish got a second place in Spain last season. He's about to replicate it this season. He loves this track. <laughs> but instead he's going to go for the win. I reckon he can get the win here. Or oh, one more lap. He's going to have to dive on. I would have died from oh, that. I think Quirky got it. Don't don't say until the fat lady sings. Imagine if he spins around. That's why I'm. Go for it. I was late on the brakes. I'm crazy. Oh, he needs attraction. He needs attraction. Oh he's God. gonna get it. Oh, he's gonna be so close. Oh, Quirky was gonna hold on to win the Spanish Grand Prix. Crazy Fish oh. is second. Rise in third. Storage third. Oh, Storage four, third. Ben fifth. Matty sixth. Horizon seventh. <laughs> Legends after unfortunate. Fortunate state to call restart is going to come in eighth. Roberts will keep ninth. 
by retiring, so two points. Yeah, difference. Ben got P5 after all that. That was a crazy race. Matty points. When you thought someone had the race win, it then turns up all the way around. Whoa. That was a crazy race. Oh my word. Arguably, what a race. Ben should have won that end without that. If he didn't get that pen. Yeah. Just how racing goes. I know we'll be back next week. Going back for that win. <laughs> Monaco. Crazy first driver of the day in the game. Yep. Yeah. Look, that driver of the day boat will go out on Twitter later tomorrow. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, most likely. Or tonight. Yeah, that's unfortunate for Legends Hunt. Just how the league racing goes, unfortunately. Oh, Slytherin, that's mean. <laughs> I'll invite top three. Yeah. So let's go over your classifications. Quirky Turtle start, started on pole and wins the race after the event for final lap, holding on with 16 lap old hards. Crazy Fish comes in second, starting 12. He did a superb strategy, he deserved that second place. Storage gets third. His first race is back this season, so good stuff for him. See the two where they finish fourth. Ben good after. Evening. Good evening, Storage. <laughs> ben, after an eventful race, got fifth. Matty, who's happy in the chat, got sixth place. Ryzen got seventh. Legend got eighth. Then Bobbitt's got ninth. Even though he retired, he'll still get them two points. Tornado got tenth. Then outside your points you got Eyes, you got Cornish, you got Gunty, you got One Tribal, you got Pigeon Munch, Cornet Star, Evo, Hudson, ZW. And there you go, Money Biscuit, if you want to take a screenshot. Um, so uh, can you do first and third, and I'll do second? Yeah, we've got everyone in. Uh, no, we're missing first. Uh, who was third? Storage? Yeah. Third was storage, yeah. I'll just give Mr. Quincy on this Williams screen. I'll see if I can invite Quirky Nine again. In a while. What car are you, storage? Williams, yeah? Yeah, Williams. Alright. So, storage, I believe this is your first race back this season. Am I wrong or am I right about that? Oh, I did Bahrain and then, yeah, two weeks off. Because of uni. Yeah, so um, it's, a, it's a good race for you. Two weeks back, you got a third place. Hectic race, hectic. How was that final couple of laps for you? Please uh, tell me about it. I was not happy about the safety car. I thought we had like a safe um, podium, <sighs> double podium for Williams, and I knew the softs were coming from behind. And yeah, the restart, I think Legends didn't even heat up his tyres, and mine were at. 75 degrees maybe and then we yeah the softs had better grip Quirky defended them perfectly positioned right yeah and just hold on because Horizon had like 15 seconds so yeah just keep position no damage yeah bring it home um I don't want to say this but um it's a good day for Williams one and one and three um do you think this was a good or bad track for you, pace-wise? I had good pace, but then my game broke down in qualifying. That screwed me a bit over, because I had to start at P9, and I felt like I could start like front or second row. But yeah, in the end I could make it up, because I, I had pace and I knew that. Next week is the track that no one likes, Monaco. <laughs> <laughs> How do you feel about it? I don't know. I haven't practiced it. I've done it like oh, half a year ago and I didn't feel it too much. <laughs> well, let's well, see. I hope your no practice strategy works. I will practice for it. I will. Okay, cool. <laughs> I think you need no practice around that track. <laughs> 
Um, you got any pe um, questions for Storage and Bait? Uh, how would how did you find out that last uh, last two lap shootout? The last two lap shootout. How how I feel? You know, what? Yeah. Yeah, it was crazy. Um, carnage behind me. I think uh, who was behind me? Crazy, no. Caesar to wizard or some someone like that had a uh, yeah, big shunt with another car. Legends it's crash. And crazy soft, the soft battled hard. Yeah, just get. Yeah, it's a bit of lottery. Get first or second because everybody's fully committed to win and. Yeah. Hard to stay in this. Okay then. Yeah. So if you wanna take away with Crazy Fish. First of all, congrats Crazy on the P two. How would you sum up your race and qualifying? Um qualifying first? Was a letdown. Uh, I could have easily been in Q3, but I just messed up my medium run, uh, so I wasn't gonna go and qualify on softs. And then the race was uh, fairly bad. I got spun at the start, uh, and then I couldn't really recover too many places because there was only BSCs, no safety cars. Um, then everything was going to plan. I wasn't making up too much pace after I pit up for softs until the safety car came out. And then I pitted on the safety car when no one else did, because why not? Um, I just got lucky that I just cut the end of the pack before the safety car came in, and then uh, carnage ensued. Um, I did try catch Quirky, uh, but he just was too quick, and I wasn't going to dive bomb on the last lap. Uh, any chance during that race did you feel like, yeah, I could win this race? No, not at all. Ah, uh, many other people <laughs> should have won that race, but people were taken out. Yeah, uh, it's Monaco next week. How do you feel for that? Uh, I haven't raced Monaco in a league race since 2018, so yeah, that's gonna be fun. We'll see how it goes. I normally like Monaco, so we'll see. Yeah. Anyways, uh, good luck for Monaco and congrats on the podium. Over Cheers. to you, Unity. Yeah, um, before we go on to Quirky, by any chance, do you like Spain, Crazy Fish? No, but me and you have history at Spain, don't we? <laughs> <laughs> I was just saying that because I kind of last season you got second there and then you got second here again. Yeah, I'm talking to you last season and then you both chances me on the you had a chance to win. One. Yeah, I know, it's, it's, yeah, I don't know. I like my setup, but, uh, yeah, it's a bit of a crazy uh, race. Yeah, um, GG on the second. Hopefully, you get a win next week. Unlikely, but thanks. <laughs> uh, moving on to first place with the Quirky Turtle. Um, qualifying, Q1, Q2, you topped. Then Q3, you seem to struggle a bit. What happened in qualifying in Q3? Um, couldn't really nail the lap. Uh, I don't know whether it's because the cooler temperatures are and what, but I, I did it in Portugal last week where I went quicker in Q3 than Q1. Uh, sorry, other way around, Q, I was quicker in Q1 than Q3. So, um, I mean, I still put on pole, so I was obviously quite happy with that. Uh, but I think there's a bit more left in my lap, so. But yeah, the points are all about the race, so. <laughs> yeah, um,. It was a quiet race, a majority of the race. Obviously, that stage caught at the end caused <laughs> yeah, some crazy stuff. <laughs> <laughs> what, what did you make for the stage car when you start, and what did you think when you saw a crazy fish behind you and then fresh off? Oh, well, it's. I don't know what you say. The safety car didn't really do one lap, I don't think. Um, I was just coming into sector three, and like, the tyres were cold. I was like, oh, I can't get any heat in this. It's like safety cars coming for, oh, great, here we go. And then obviously, you're trying the hardest to get some. Um, heat into your tyres, they obviously got crazy on the softs, so I was like, yeah, it's going to be a bit crazy, but just blasted on the ARS down the main straight and uh, just stick the car in the middle of the circuit and then kind of take it from there. 
uh, made my hug on quite nice. So, but I think another lap, and yeah, I think we're about me, so. <coughs> um, were you Division Three last season? I was, yeah. Yeah, I thought you was. Uh, you, you, you made good progress in this division, don't you think? Uh, yeah, I think it's kept the rhythm going. Um, I'm practicing loads, so um, it, you know it, sh it should pay off. Um, but yeah, I think the pace is, is there with some of the guys. There's definitely some uh, faster guys in this division. Um, I need to work more on my race pace. Yeah, I can nail the lap in qualifying, but I always tend to struggle in the race, especially the earlier laps. I'm a bit too conservative. On to the question that everyone likes answer. <laughs> what do you think of Monaco? Uh, um, yeah, I don't think I've raced there, like, ever. <laughs> so it should be fun. Now, <laughs> uh, yeah, I'll put some practice in, see where we go, but I might just not do qualifying to start at the back. <laughs> just drive around nice and slow. <laughs> the vibe I'm getting from this is either they haven't raced Monaco, they don't practice Monaco, <laughs> is what I'm getting from this. Yeah, I don't think nobody does. Uh, it's a bit of a free for all there, so it should be good for them next week. Uh, you got any questions, Evade, before we wrap it up? Uh, yeah. Did uh, do you know why? Do you know when he was behind? I think it was Pigeon. Did you think at any chance you could actually overtake him before he retired? Uh, nah, the gap stayed the same. It was like that train. So nobody was really pulling away, nobody was dropping behind, so it was, again, the straight just isn't long enough for here to, to, to really overtake, unless the person in front hasn't got a DRS, so um, I guess I was just sat behind him and hope that you know, the guys in front make mistakes and pick penalties up. I just try to keep it clean. I don't even think I got one warning all race, so that's kind of what I wanted. <laughs> Uh, congrats on the win. Thank you. Yeah, uh, congratulations to all three of you. Uh, good podium. Um, yeah, but let's wrap up after a chaotic final three laps. Gets me some Abu Dhabi vibes. But we go, we move. Um, tomorrow, actually before I wrap this up, this, is, this has been Division 2 tonight, but tomorrow is Division 5 where Invade will be racing after commentating for the past two races. So that'll be fun to watch. Your um, commentators will be BF1 and Eastern at the moment, but that could all change. Yeah. What were you going to say, Invade? I was just going to say that. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so then, then commentators could change, but apart from that, join us tomorrow for Division 5, and join us next week where me and Invade will go around Monaco with, with the Division 2 lot where have 20 drivers starting and 20 drivers finishing, let's hope. <laughs> but apart from that, uh, see you next week and see you tomorrow.